Hello and welcome back to another Computer Sluggish tutorial. Before we get started, have you subscribed to my YouTube channel yet? If not, be sure to click on the big red subscribe button on my main page. And once you have done this, don't forget to click on that bell to be the first to get notified when I upload a new video. In today's video, I will be showing you how to install the latest critical device software update for your Fivo Sport or any other Garmin wristband you have. To start off with, all you need to do is head on over to the link that's in the description below and you will end up on a page that looks like this. Once you are on this page, you need to click on download for Windows and you need to go save file. Once the download has finished, we now need to run the setup file. You now need to go, I have read and agreed to the terms and conditions, which can be read on this link here. You now need to go install. Install has finished. We can now click on launch Garmin Express. And you now need to go get started. And we now need to click on add a device. You now need to plug in your Fivo Sport or whatever Garmin wristband you do have. You do need to use the cable that came with your Garmin wristband and just simply plug it into the slot that you use to charge your wristband up and then plug it into the USB port on your computer. I'm going to do that now. And once it has been plugged in, as you can see, it is currently searching for a Garmin device on my machine and hopefully in the second it will pop up. And there we go. As you can see, it has found my device. If it didn't manage to find your device, don't worry because you can actually select your device manually or you can try and search for the device again. It might just be that you didn't have enough time to plug it in. Once you have got this screen, you now need to go add device and we now need to click on sign in as long as you have a Garmin account. If you don't, then you need to create an account. Once you have signed in, you now need to just make sure the settings are correct and you need to go next. You now need to adjust a few more of the settings on here just to complete your profile. And then once you are happy with that, we can now go next again. And you now need to select whichever option you want. I'm just going to go no. You now need to press close. And we now need to click on this little refresh button here. And it will begin to check for the latest update. And as you can see, I do have the latest software version, which is currently 3.4. And if it has managed to find a new update for you to install, it will simply say here, update now or download new update and then it will do everything for you. I would also like to just add, I've just unplugged my Fivo Sport and it has just begun to download a update on the actual wristband, which means that when it was doing the syncing process and that, it must have quickly downloaded the latest software version to my Fivo Sport without me realizing. And that is why it said here, you are up to date. And that is it for this video. I hope this tutorial helped. If it did, hit the like button below and subscribe for more computer sluggish tutorials.